Hi, I'm Julia, an illustrator and sketchbook artist. Today I want to share my best tips with you on how you can build a sketching habit. For me, drawing and painting in my sketchbook on a daily basis is a deeply relaxing process and I find it also builds my creative muscles and my imagination. So my art practice changed a lot when I truly embraced my sketchbook for what it was and started sketching in nature and my art got a lot more interesting as a result. So I find myself more interested in the world around me and there's always something to explore outside. So if you're looking for ways how to integrate sketching and drawing into your life and make sketching a regular habit, then watch this video. I want to share some practical tips to make sketching a regular habit. The first thing would be to sketch regularly. So make time in your day for your new habit. It doesn't have to be long, so 5 to 10 minutes per day should be enough. Often you will find that you want to continue after that time anyway. By drawing in your sketchbook every day, you will slowly build these nerve paths in your brain that will make it more likely that you return to it the next day. Another great tactic is to make time for the most important things in your day first and then stick to this routine. This could look like getting up 10 minutes early to have some time in the morning for yourself to sketch or making time in the evening for a quick sketching routine. So my tip would be to select a time in your day when you want to sit down with your sketchbook and put this into your calendar so that you can remember it. My next tip would be to make it easy. Make it easy to start. Have your art supplies near you in a dedicated place so you don't have to search for them and you can start drawing immediately. You don't need many supplies for sketching, so this could look like a sketchbook, a pencil and a watercolor set in your maybe your kitchen shelf or near a window where you can look outside. And if you want to sketch outside, then consider preparing um, a, a sketching kit, a bag, and have it ready at all times so that you can just grab it and go. I've written a bit about it on how to assemble such a sketching kit on my blog, which I will link below. So my tip for this step would be to assemble your sketching kit and put it where you can grab it immediately and start. My next tip is to connect sketching with another habit. So one of the most effective methods is to chain a new habit to an existing habit and this makes it more natural to start. If you think about it, then you already do that other thing on a regular basis, so it makes sense to connect the new thing you want to do with the thing you're already doing. In the case of daily sketching, this could be watching birds from your window and sketching a bit while you do this, or having your morning coffee and sketching while you drink that. If you want to start sketching outside more with, for example, a nature journal, then bring your sketching kit to outdoor activities like hiking or a walk in the park. So my tip would be to think about what you are likely to do before, after or while you're sketching and organize your drawing sessions around these times. My next tip would be to stay accountable. Finding accountability is a great method to make a new habit stick and in the case of drawing it's also more fun. <laughs> there are different ways to stay accountable with the help of others and finding an accountability partner is one method for this. Essentially you tell a friend about this new habit or a family member and now that it's out in the open it will help you follow through with it. So even better is to make sketching a social activity that involves a few friends you could organize a regular sketching event together or go for walks and sketch outside or take walks th through the city and sketch there. Um, and another way to make yourself publicly accountable is to share your work regularly with like-minded people on the internet, like on a blog or an online community. So this is one of the reasons that, that I started to share my sketchbook on my blog. And um, yeah, I found it a, a really good way to stay accountable. So my tip would be to surround yourself with a creative community and either join a local group or an online community. So my next tip would be to just start somewhere. The best thing is not to overthink it and simply start. If you want to make art on a regular basis and integrate it into to your daily life, then use one of, or several of the methods above. So this will make it far more likely that you will not only start but 
keep this new habit. And don't forget that sketching should be a way to bring more fun and creativity into your life. For me, this totally worked and, and paid off in several ways, which is why I'm such a big proponent of sketching in nature as a way to connect with the world and with your creativity. So um, you won't see these positive effects if you don't give it a try. So this would be my last tip to just get started. Just do it now. Either get out your sketchbook today or put an X into your calendar for your next drawing session and, and really just do it. Just get started. Okay, <clears throat> those were my tips to make sketching a regular habit for you. Uh, thank you for watching. I hope this video was useful for you. And if you like this, then please like and subscribe to make sure you will get updates on future videos like this. I hope you'll have a great day. Take care and see you soon. Bye.